What's up, guys? It's Bro Man here in Destiny, and I just thought, um, you know, it's about goddamn time we just talked about this update. You know what I'm saying? Like, what? It's the April update, so we want to know what's going on. So, here are my thoughts of the April update. All right, it's not a, it's not probably going to be a long video, but I wanted you guys to know my thoughts now that I've had uh, two days to play it. You know what I mean? And give it a give it a little looky loo. So one, uh, I think that hands down, this is the absolute best update for anyone that is a solo or casual player to date. Super, like just everything about this update um, is designed to take you as a casual player and a minimal amount of time investment to maximum light level like you're gonna go from nothing to something uh, no matter how much time you're spending there's all there is a much greater chance that you will be experiencing a positive trend in your light level every time you get a loot drop now it's smart loot's much smarter it's not genius loot there's still sometimes you're gonna get stuff that goes along a straight line but I will tell you, you that uh, for me, you know, I've been playing for, I've put 24 hours in since the update approximately. And I'm, I'm 327, I got a smattering of cool gear. Um, and I've only run the raid once, the nightfall once, and done a bunch of strikes. That's about it. And it's yielded a lot of good results for me. Um, I think that if you're a casual player, you know, it's, it's perfect for you. Um, now I know. All right, so that's the that's the fucking delicious part of the review, right? That's the delicious part. If you're a hardcore player, you're you're waiting for something to make Destiny change your mind. This update for the hardcore players, it's gonna um, it's gonna let you progress in light level a little bit. Um, right now, the challenge mode isn't super challenging for Prison of Elders, so that might be bothering you. But I I have some. I have some suspicions that they could change the scoring systems to make it much more, uh, the right word, challenging, <laughs> um, you know, more strategical, more tactical. Right now, kind of, it seems a lot like a tutorial mission, so I have my hopes up still for Challenge of Elders. It's the first week, you know, and they don't want to bring in the crazy ball crushing difficulty yet. Um, so that might be something on the horizon, but we don't know. Uh, honestly, if you're a hardcore player, uh, you'll probably burn through this content in like, you know, 50, 60 hours and you'll move on to your next game. And you know what? For a free update, it's not bad. It's got everything set up for the next DLC, which is probably going to be this fall. And then we'll have a whole lot more fun and exciting things to do. And, you know, you never know what, what might be coming in that DLC. Um, but yeah, for the casual player, uh, more consistent uh, light level increase for your your solo time, uh, more consistent light level increase across all events, um, and most importantly, the ability to play solo if you want to, um, or casually if you want to, and still feel like you're making progress. That has been the biggest complaint, and I know Destiny, Bungie still needs to add, mat add matchmaking, man. Like, they need to. Um, but aside from just adding flat matchmaking and letting players decide their own fate, um, you know, this is the best thing. This is the next best thing. They think it's great. So uh, for all you casual and uh, solo players out there, enjoy the update. For the hardcore folks that might be feeling a little put off, you know, I get it. I understand. Uh, wait on Challenge of Elders. There are some scoring combinations that could be really punishing. We also got some more bosses to see. Um, and you know, if it ends up that none of that stuff is great, we still got more content coming along. And as much as I hate still saying that, uh, it is true. So those are my thoughts on why this is great for the casual solo player. Thank you for watching. Make sure to rate, comment, subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next video talk about all sorts of stuff maybe talk about matchmaking we'll see thanks for watching guys and i'll see you next time in destiny